how excited are you for this weekend? Um, I'm very excited. I think it's going to be fun wrestling in the Humboldt gym. Super, super intimate. A lot of, like, you know, fans right on top of you. So, nothing like I've ever wrestled before. So, Grandview's uh, not regularly on the schedule. You go about scouting them, preparing for them any differently than you would a, a Big 12 opponent? Yeah, I think it's good to to know who you're wrestling and know, just have a little background on them. Like Dresser always says, at least get to, at least learn their lead leg. You know, you gotta, you gotta have a little bit of a game plan, so. When you go about scouting an opponent that you're not super familiar with, or maybe you just don't pay attention to NIA wrestling, what, what, what's your process like? Um, I don't really, you know, put like a lot of thought into it, but I like to know their lead leg, you know, like their first shot, like their, their go-to shot, just maybe their first move on bottom, but other than that, I really dig too deep into it. Did you spend your summer in the weight room? You were a little bit. Thanks. Uh, yeah, you know, I got a guy like Durbin um, and, you know, guys like Yonker try and always say they're bigger than me, so I got to eat a lot and lift a lot. <laughs> Was that ultimately the decision to, I don't want to say, like, you fully reshaped your body, but, like, clearly the emphasis to put muscle on the summer, yeah? Um, yeah, well, you know, I was 97 for a while, so I always had to catch up. Also had a knee surgery last year, so I wasn't really doing a lot of lower half, but i just been, yeah, I'm just lifting a lot, eating a lot. It's like a year-round thing pretty much, so. You feel more comfortable, more confident now that you've had a couple of seasons fully dedicated to heavyweight. Underwear. Yeah, I love heavyweight. Heavyweight's awesome. They're gonna cut weight. You just wrestle. It's so much more fun. <laughs> Where do you feel like you've grown the most? Um, definitely on my feet. Younger's world class on his feet. So I owe a lot of it to him. Dresser, you know, they spent a lot of time with us, um, just on setups and good positioning. But you know, I have good partners here that always push me. Um, I think I could always work on bottom. Work on top, but I think I've grown a lot on my feet. Is that just product of wrestling with younger? Just wrestling with younger. Um, when Kyvin was was wrestling a lot, he always gave me you know good advice. But yeah, I say wrestling with younger a lot, a lot, get a lot of different feels from him because he's a little unorthodox. Well, that probably helps just like you know thinking of most of the heavyweights around the country today, right? Like they're not they're not the push and pull heavyweights. Like. Yeah, for sure. No, it's you can see like the meta has changed a lot. Like a lot of you know smaller. It's getting a little bigger again, but. You know, it's more wrestling now, not like sumo wrestling like it used to be. Yeah. What do you look forward to the the most for this weekend wrestling in Humboldt? Um, just to wrestle again. I think that's fun. My last season, so every event's, you know, I'm just trying to savor it. Thank you. Thanks, Thanks. Sam.